What's up, team? It's your girl, Brittany. So I'm just on here to um, talk about Amber Lynn Reed for a second. So I, in my life, would never subscribe to this person ever. But she's somebody that I click on every now and again to see um, if anything has progressed or she's actually followed through with what she's talking about all the time. As in losing weight, calories, and, and nothing's wrong with her, and she's water weight and all kind of shit. Look, girl, you need to, like, pump the brake, okay? You really do. You are so obese. You're killing yourself. Why in the freak do people allow this behavior? They're subscribing and entertaining. The more subscribers she has, the more money she's getting, the more money she has, the more food she's going to get. If she ain't got no damn subscribers, she's not getting paid for YouTube. That's the only source of income that she has. So why in the hell do y'all comment underneath her and talk shit, but you're supporting her habit by subscribing to her and making her have money? I, if you guys do not support her, stop subscribing to her. She's killing herself. She's freaking killing herself. It's disgusting. I don't understand how a human being can look at themselves every day in the mirror and point out every single thing and, uh, and blame it on something else. I'm swollen because of water weight. I am this because of this. I don't go to a weight loss doctor because he told me to eat only six to 800 calories a day, but that's not good enough. That's not healthy. No, a normal person, that's what a normal person eats, including activities, gym, walking, cleaning their house, whatever. But having a normal job, walking around, I don't care where you work, at least you're on your damn feet. You, my friend, I don't have friends like that, so no, you're not my damn friend, but people like that are lazy. They're in denial, they're lazy as hell, and they keep on living off of bullshit. They make their self-belief shit that is not true. She likes to talk. And I just seen this video, and she was telling people a comparison to her in January 2019 to, what are we, in August 2019, she only gained five pounds. That's what she said, she only gained five pounds. And she compared these two pictures, bitch, you are fat. You are completely overweight. You're not even fat. You're fucking, you're obese, girl. You are killing yourself. And the and, and she's saying she took a nap, but then she says she don't take naps. And then she just woke up from a nap and she missed lunch. So now she's eating two sandwiches instead of one because she missed lunch. Are you serious? I don't understand from a human being to a human being I don't understand how you could allow yourself to go that low I really flipping don't it's disgusting you should not be on the internet you should not uh, you should not be allowed to make videos on the internet you shouldn't you're teaching these children that are actually genuinely watching you you're teaching them it's okay to be like that and it's not a healthy lifestyle is the best thing you could do for yourself getting your ass up and working a nine to five or longer shifts you know it's cool to be on youtube and making and making videos and shit but you're not going anywhere you're not doing nothing you're sitting your ass on this bed on the floor because you cannot even get up on a normal bed making these videos about how you don't do this and you got all these problems and you're depressed and shit like that yeah anyone that size is going to be depressed anyone that size is going to have problems but instead of you working on the problem and fixing it and becoming a better human being you're hurting yourself even more by just shoving food in your damn mouth you think weighing yourself every single day for 100 days is going to make you lose weight no, it's not. 
you're really not even supposed to be looking at the scale when you're actually trying to lose fucking weight. Why? Because the scale don't balance out the fat and, and your muscle content. It don't do that. I go to the gym every day. I go to the fucking gym every day. I don't eat shit food. And I rarely look on the fucking scale. The only time I even look on the scale is when I go see my gynecologist trying to have a damn baby. That's the only fucking time I look at a damn scale. I don't sit there and be like, oh, this magic scale is going to make me lose fucking weight if I step on it every day. It's not going to happen. You're living in a fantasy world, girl. You need to wake the fuck up. You need to wake up. And these people leaving hateful comments on your shit need to wake up. If they're subscribed to you, unsubscribe to her so she stops getting them on me. You're feeding her habit. And a lot of sick people out there are subscribed to you talking shit. Unsubscribe to talk shit. You don't need to subscribe to talk shit. There's sick people that want to subscribe and, and to see this girl die. I'll be I'll be there to watch the damn video. I'm sorry, I will, because it's entertaining. But I damn sure ain't gonna be feeding her habit by subscribing and giving her that extra bit of change. Not gonna happen. My life ain't perfect and no one is. But hell, I'm walking around, I'm getting my ass up and doing something about my life. Are you, Amberlynn? Or are you steadily making up excuses so you don't have to actually do it? I feel bad for Becky. I really do. That that that's a good girl. That's a good girl from what I see on a camera. And you are ruining her life. You really are. You'd rather post a video of you putting glitter on your face thinking that you're being funny when you're really not instead of going to support her in whatever family issues that she has going on. That's bullshit to me. That's complete utter fucking bullshit. If my significant other had family issues, I would be there. If you guys are really that strong and connected like you say you are, her family is your family, isn't it? Come on, bro. You're not fooling nobody. You're not fooling me. I'm going to keep watching because I'm nosy. And I ain't got nothing else going when I'm sitting my ass Googling your name. So I'll be watching. But I'm just letting you know, girl, you are in denial and you're never going to change. You're going to keep on killing yourself because you ain't got nothing. You have, you look at yourself and you're like, this will never happen. <clears throat> you like making videos because you like to talk. You really, you can't even walk to the kitchen, to the couch without... <clears throat> <clears throat> you're out of breath. I'm not making this 10 minute video. I'm just ranting about Amberlynn Reed because I really find it ridiculous. And every time I watch her videos, I always want to say something. Always want to fucking say something. And I don't. Well, now I am. So. All right, team. If you guys watch her and don't support her, please comment down below. And if you do watch her and support her, comment down below and let me know what you think.